So I want to talk about uh, a couple of formatting issues, one in, in particular here, that I'm noticing with a couple of blogs that have to do with this kind of um, bleeding over. Uh, you've posted an image, a nice image, but it bleeds over into your text. And there's a real nice quick fix for this that I want to get into here to show you how that goes through and uh, how you can um, create um, a different width within your columns that way. So I'm going to go into design. And in design, uh, you might want to go to layout but that's really kind of not the place to go to do this. The tools are actually found in theme. I'm already defaulted the theme, and I'm gonna go in and customize here, and that'll bring up a real-time editing window so I can see my edit happen in real time right here as I go through and make adjustments. So here, I'm just going to go into adjust widths, and I have uh, two different types of widths that I can do the entire blog or the sidebar itself. And you, if you watch down here as I adjust the sidebar, you can see where that's going to, and that might be enough to go through and, and create the, the proper gutter, this uh, line here that I would, might want to go through and, and give me the space that I need. Um, or I can adjust the width of the entire blog, okay? Uh, and that goes through and, and broadens the, the space that I have to work with. And that's really nice if uh, everybody is looking at your blog on a nice big screen. Uh, this, this reformats, I'm hoping you've noticed that for uh, iPhones and tablets and things that way. Uh, so what I'm encouraging you to do is play with these two settings in order for you to go through and get the kind of uh, gutter here that you need to separate uh, out what's going on. And once you've done that, then you can go through and apply that to the blog and then uh, we go back to that and Bob's your uncle. Okay, it's all set and ready to go. Uh, but this is bugging me a little, <laughs> a little much here. So I'm going to go through and uh, actually go back into the post and I'm going to uh, just left hand justify that there and then I'm going to go back into the theme and I knowing that this image width is really the main width I'm going to do for all my images for this I'm going to go through and reset then my column widths to default to that size you see here um, well the entire blog goes to a thousand thirty uh, pixels I'm going to bring this up here, and what I'm going to go by is this margin going on here to match the width of the image. Let me see if I can. Yeah. There, and it lines up. Okay, so now I have a, a, an even gutter happening here uh, now that I have gone through and left hand justified the image for what it is that I'm doing. So um, I hope this helps you out. Uh, play along, play along, um, <laughs> go through this and, and Play it out on your blog. Um, there's nothing that you can do that would make it that, that's irreversible. Okay, you can go back and change it if you want, but um, uh, the more you use these formatting tools, the uh, the more you will realize the design that you're after. Okay, good luck.